improving our Super Tux Tux. Who dies when he hits green kryptonite, but can plow through concrete and still survive for a little bit. And you can also control his flying somewhat. Okay. What we're going to do today is add red kryptonite. So let's go ahead and I'm just going to add in a cube here. Add a cube, scale it down, scale it up on the z-axis a little bit. I'm just going to put it right here for right now. Uh, then I'm going to give it a new material, new texture, image, open, and then I'm going to choose a PNG I got called Red Kryptonite. Now, for those of you who are not familiar with Superman, Superman, when he gets close to green kryptonite, it weakens him and kills him. But green kryptonite, or, or, or red kryptonite, what it does, and let's give it this a red color, and we probably should give this one a green color just so we know. Okay. Um, oh, and we probably should make these shadeless. Shadeless, there we go. Same with this one, shadeless. Red kryptonite turns Superman bad so we want the same thing to happen so what we're going to do is with this here red kryptonite we're going to make it a rigid body and box so that it falls over when it gets hit we're going to give it a property though a property of red we'll just call it red we'll call it red k okay we're going to go to our superman here choose him oh we did package in yeah i packaged in that texture okay uh, we're going to say, here, let's make this full screen. We're going to say when he has a collision with red K. So here, that's just a label up here. This is the actual property we're looking for. Red K. We're going to then connect here. Red K. And here we'll say uh, edit object. We are going to add an object of bad tux. So tux. But we also want to destroy the original. So we're going to say edit object oh wait we don't have to do that we already have a death we can now connect this to the death we already have and should now when he hits that red kryptonite destroy the superman but create an evil tux well it destroyed him i was afraid that might happen it's not creating it because of his um he's dying before he's creating it so Let's see, and I don't think changing the order of these help, but we'll give that a try first. But I know what to do if this doesn't work. Yeah, okay. So, first off, let's move that back down so that we don't have too much crossing going on here. In fact, move that one. That doesn't matter. Okay. Um, so instead of going straight to death here, we don't want him to die. He has a life force that um, that we count down earlier. So what we're going to do here is we're going to say da, 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 up, up, and away, death time. We're going to connect that there. But we're also going to change that property from 50 because we don't want him to last that long. We're going to say... life five and we're going to set his property of life down to five that should give us enough time to create the bad tux before the good tux is destroyed let's see if that works it didn't it didn't it didn't <laughs> okay so let's see let's have a quick look and then we'll check out the, the variables so when he has a collision with red kryptonite. Oh, I know. I think. Life equals five. 
and then we're going to say uh, here death time that's not what we want to connect to we want to connect to hit because hit is what tells it to hit otherwise it's just subtracting once not continuously so <laughs> seriously so it still didn't create our bad tux hmm add object bad tux forever let's set this to 10 let's uh, we'll set that to 20 should be creating Let's go into wireframe mode and see if we see if he's Hmm. This is confusing. This should be working. Oh, I know the problem. You can't add an object that's on the same layer. So what I need to do is I need to move one of these bad tuxes that I'm generating to another level layer. So we'll move him down here to this layer. Now, a lot of what we just did was probably unnecessary. Uh, so we got bad tux there. Uh, we want to choose our super tux here. We can probably go back into textured mode. And we'll give this a quick little rundown first. Oops. I keep clicking the wrong buttons here. Move that over. Grab, move that over. Okay. Okay. So now we have the issue of he's generating that 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 bad tux, but since he's generating in the same same spot that the super tux is in, it's um killing him. So we need to go back and change those unnecessary things we've added. So down here. So we've got what do we have selected? We should have our super tux selected. Super tux. Clyde with red kryptonite. Let's remove this hit. We don't need that. We can completely remove this here. And we will connect to death there. So let's see if that fixes our problem. There we go. But he's really, really small because our super tux has uh, been scaled down in size so let's apply his size his scale there and now he is a bad tux bad tux okay uh, so let's see what happens if we have him selected Save this every once in a while. Make all this full screen. I'm just minimizing stuff here to get some of it out of the way. We're going to then, and we might change his picture from just one of those regular tuxes to a bizarro tux uh, of some sort. Um, but what was I just thinking about doing? I can't remember now. I was about to do something. Oh, I was going to see what happens if we add camera tracking to him. So we should have a... Bad tux. Always. And... Uh, what is it? What is it under... Yeah, track to camera. Let's see how that looks, if that prevents it from turning. Oh no, where'd he go? That was unexpected. <laughs> hmm. 
Interesting. Okay, we will play with that more later on. For right now, we'll remove that, what we just created. Okay, but we do have our red kryptonite, and when the super tux is in, he turns into a bad tux. Which we can still kill. Should be able to kill with a super tux. Let's, let's go into wireframe mode here. Okay. Okay, so he's not staying on the, on the y-axis, which I thought we had applied to all these tuxes. So real quick, let's go ahead and go here, choose him, and say... Always and constraint and we will set this to Y. Once again this will prevent him from moving back and forth and that's why we were unable to shoot him that one time because he had moved too far forward. So boom. Okay, so uh, that's it for this tutorial. Moving along in this game. Hopefully, we'll have a full game in the near future. Thanks for watching. Please visit filmsbychris.com. That's Chris with a K. Filmsbychris.com forward slash POP for pissed off penguins. Pop. And um, I hope that you have a great day.